This one thing has made me more money than my entire life. I'm gonna tell you a story, one that I'm not very proud of, but I need to tell you anyways because I wanna show you exactly what's possible. Roughly about five or six years ago, I was working for a news station making roughly $11 an hour. This was before I joined the military. There was a point whenever I was working for the news station that I had to sell my Xbox just to be able to afford gas. That Xbox is something that I enjoyed quite a lot, but I needed to do something in order to make it to payday because payday was about three or four days away from now. And I was sitting there in my apartment thinking, what can I do? Because I only have 23 or 24 cents in my bank account. So I decided to sell my Xbox for about $50. I sold it to GameStop. As you know, selling games to GameStop, you're selling them for pennies on the dollar. So I think I sold my Xbox for roughly $50. It was in perfect condition. Anyways, sold it for $50 and I made it to payday. Fast forward two or so years and I'm starting my real estate investing journey, but I'm not investing in real estate just yet. There was something else that I had to do. I need to get my mind right with money because I had such a negative mindset whenever it came to making money that I wasn't able to attract any money at all. I was repelling money and it could show you whenever I was so broke I wasn't able to pay for gas I was just repelling money I had 23 24 cents in my bank account I didn't even mean to do this this is just something that kind of happened and I attribute a lot of that to a book that I read that's called you're a badass and making money I'm gonna leave a link to that book in the description down below if you want to go check that out and in that book I don't even think it mentions the word manifestation but I'm a 100% believer in manifestation if you don't know what manifestation is it's basically, you know, you, you think about something and it's gonna happen. But this was my first experience with manifestation. I can 100% say that it works. Now, it's not the type of manifestation where you just think about it and, and it happens, right? You have to put in the action. Now, I wanna show you how you can manifest literally anything you want in your life. So if you just take five minutes out of your day, you can definitely manifest more money into your life in the next year. Because this is 100% of the reason where I am today, where I have about four or five different income streams and I'm not broke. I don't have 24 cents in the bank account anymore. It literally only takes about five minutes. So if you're ready to know how to do this correctly, go ahead and hit that like button for me and we'll get started. First thing that you're going to need to do is you're going to need to close your eyes. I'll do it with you, but you seriously need to be doing this. Close your eyes and you're going to imagine your perfect life, the house, the car, how much money you have in the bank account, how much money you're going to have coming in every single month, every single year. The, the type of significant other that you want. The trick to manifestation is you got to bring in all five of your senses. So your touch, your hearing, your smelling, your taste. So here, take a listen to what my perfect life looks like. Now, I'm imagining myself on a three-story mansion. I'm running my hand, right? I'm running my hand across the balcony, like the, the edge of it where you don't fall off. I'm running my hand over it. I'm feeling the cement that the, the balcony is made of. I'm hearing the leaves rustle in the wind. I'm feeling that warm sunshine on my face. Whenever I stepped outside on the balcony, I can smell the freshly cut grass. This is literally just one portion of my perfect life. I'm imagining literally everything. So you need to be very detailed whenever it comes to manifestation because if you don't, it's just not gonna work. You need to bring in all five of your senses because believe it or not, your brain cannot distinguish between what is real and what it is you're imagining. It's weird, there's a lot of science that goes involved with it, but you can just look that up on your own time. But for right now, take my word for it. You also need to be tying in your feelings. So whenever you're looking at your bank account, Whenever you're doing this, you need to be tying in your feelings as well. So whenever you're imagining, you know, you playing with your kids, you need to be thinking about, yeah, all the different details, but you need to be thinking about your feelings. Like, how are you feeling in that moment? Whenever you look at your bank account and you see that number, how are you feeling associated with that number? So for me, for my example, whenever I take a look into my bank account and my perfect life in my imagination, I'm thinking of $2.2 million coming to my bank account every single year. Now I see that on my app on my phone and I'm just looking at it with a sense of pride that I did this, I built this life. Now this life has yet to happen, but I know it will happen. How do I know? Because literally everything is leading up to it. My real estate investing, I manifested in detail, like how many properties did I want by the age of 27? How much cash flow did I want by the age of 27? What kind of properties were they gonna be? What am I gonna do after I get these properties? This YouTube channel, I manifested in detail. How I was gonna feel when I reached my first 1,000, 2,000, 3,000, I'm not there yet, but 10,000 subscribers. And I'm manifesting, right? I'm seeing that number on my computer screen. I'm feeling it. I'm feeling my, the screen on my laptop with my finger. I'm looking at the monthly income that I'm that's coming in from YouTube. And I have this feeling of pride because I did this. I stuck with something for more than a month. 
two months, three months, and that goes along with real estate investing and a bunch of other things in my life. Everything that has happened to me whenever I first started doing this manifestation, actually putting in the work behind it, not just hoping and dreaming, because that's what it is. Whenever you're just thinking about you know, your perfect life, it's just, you're just daydreaming at that point. You're not really putting in the work. Everything has happened because I seen it first in my imagination and I worked towards it, but I'm not done yet. So whenever you're doing this and you're just sitting alone, you need to be absolutely isolated, by the way. Nothing can be distracting you. You're just sitting there for five minutes a day and manifesting your future. Whatever it looks like, again, bring in all the senses. Think of every little detail. That mansion that I was talking to you about with my perfect life, I have it detailed down to what type of flooring, what type of paint, you know, where the rooms are located inside that mansion. The railing that goes down the stairs, what does that feel like? Again, putting in one of your senses, sense of touch. What does the floor feel like whenever you're walking on it? Like what sound does it make? All this is great, but it's not gonna happen if you don't put in the work. You need to be sitting down and thinking about seriously, what do I need to be doing in order to get this life? Break it down in detail, like you're doing with your manifestation. Break it down to the detail how you're going to get there. Because I promise you, if you're not putting in the work, this manifestation is just a waste of your time. Also, you need to be sticking with this because it's just not gonna happen at the snap of your finger. You gotta be sticking with this, imagining your perfect life every single day, getting more and more detailed. Like, oh, I didn't think about the sound of the trees. Like, what sounds are they making? How does it feel whenever I'm hugging my significant other? What feeling am I feeling? whenever I'm hugging them. So if you wanna make more money in the future, I highly, highly recommend manifestation because it's worked for me, so why can't it work for you? Now, if you enjoyed that, go ahead and hit that subscribe for me down below if you believe in the power of manifestation and you're making a commitment to yourself to be doing this for the next month, two, three, year, two years, 10 years. Because I promise you, if you were doing this for a year and you're actually putting in the work, you're going to see the results of it. Like you're not gonna see the, the end result right then, but you are seeing yourself working towards it. And if you look back a year from now, whenever you started this, and you can see yourself growing into that perfect life. But if you're having trouble coming up with a game plan and exactly how to achieve that financial freedom that you are most likely wanting, or else you wouldn't have clicked on this video, go ahead and book a call with me. A link to my calendar is gonna be in the description down below. That way I can help you come up with a customized game plan based on your situation. And whatever situation that you are in, we can come up with a solution. If you wanna know exactly how to save $1,000 every single month, there's gonna be a video popping up right here that I picked out specifically for you. So go check out that video. Until the next video, I'm out, see ya.